Taco, tough day. We haven't seen too many games like this for you guys, or you know, from start to finish, not a whole lot going in your your favor. How would you sum this one up? Yeah, it was kind of a it was kind of an off uh, afternoon for us, I would say. Um, you know, all the way around, really didn't get much going, uh, really on either side of the ball. Um, and it's going to happen. I mean, we we play a lot of games. We know this, and uh, eventually, you're going to run into a few games like this. And um, today was it for us. What did you see from Kyle? Um, I think he uh, I think he battled himself a little bit out there. Um, you know, probably had a little trouble getting into any kind of rhythm. Um, I think he threw some threw some good pitches, got got a few swings and misses, um, but you know, really. Like I said, probably just just failed to garner that uh, consistency and you know that consistent release point that he's looking for throughout the start. Um, you know, it was uh, it just it just wasn't probably his uh, his day. Um, and on the other side of the ball, it was the same thing. It was kind of the same deal. Um, their pitchers they, they did a good job. They they brought a, you know a few different guys in. They all threw the ball pretty well, and um, that was the story. McGill had a stretch there where he was. You know, throwing some pretty impressive outings, and then but here the last couple have been a bit rocky. What have you seen in the change in him? Yeah, I think um, I, I think it's you know little little of the stuff we've we've been talking about. I think um, you know consistency, uh, you know strike throwing, some uh, consistency, and in, instead of um, you know when when the strike throwing is uh, you know kind of something that's probably going on or we're struggling with it a little bit you know then just just putting pitches in there just for the sake of getting the ball you know over the plate and guys getting good swings on it i think um i think maddie has really good stuff and i think he's uh he's you know certainly trying to make the adjustments out there i mean we know that he uh, he takes a lot of pride in what he does he works very hard um he does things the right way so i think he's going to go out there and, and figure out make an adjustment and and go from there positive takeaway though eats and his outing today yeah it was it was great i mean it was it was great to you know one see him out there but you know more importantly he went out there and threw the ball well he competed very well um you know it, sometimes in games like this we, we've talked about it you know you get out there and you think your role is to just go out there and throw strikes no your right. goal is to go out there and get outs and and you know do whatever you have to do follow follow the game plan even though we're uh, we're down but he went out there he did a nice job and it's a it's a great day for him Rocco, he went from Farmer to um, Ramirez, who throws a changeup. Then he went from Ramirez to Alcantara, who's a sinker guy. You think the, the different looks were, were something that kind of came into play as far as you guys not being able to sustain an offense? Well, I think that's always been something, you know, in the game that people talk about as being important and, and switching things up on hitters and, and not letting them get any sort of, you know, um, not getting comfortable in the box. Um, I, I think does make some sense, and, and maybe that did play into it. I think those guys, it's not just, you know, there's stuff that matters. I think the, each of those guys threw, threw the ball um, pretty well today, and I, I think they made good pitches on us, and, uh, you know, we did what we normally do, but today, like I said, we just ultimately did not win out, and, and they did a, you know, they ultimately did a better uh, job at it than us and, and won those at-bats, but, um, you know, we'll, we'll uh, lick our wounds tonight and show back up tomorrow and, uh, and do our thing.